guys, what's going on? My name is Eclipse, and today we are playing some more Clash Royale, and I thought I would mix it up and use a really funny deck. So today, we are going to be trying to use the Royal Giant and the Bomb Tower. So basically, I want to send the Royal Giant over the bridge, and then as he crosses the bridge, I want to put a Bomb Tower down for defense. Now, I did this on a live stream like a few weeks ago, and it didn't work out too well, and I just gave this deck one shot against the clan made to get some practice in and I kind of got my ass kicked so this probably won't end too well but let's just get right into things and see how this goes so we are against boss from RSA predators and he is a level 9 at 3100 trophies so this guy is pretty good I think at least but I'm gonna start off with the furnace hopefully this isn't a bad idea I'm not really too sure on what I should be doing um okay let's just send crap oh god this can't end well um let's send that in right there luckily we have that zap spell so we can zap out those or that goblin barrel we just got pretty lucky thank god we managed to counter him and he got no hits off whatsoever so so far we're doing pretty good also look on that right tower since this dude is a level nine he can't actually take my troops out in one hit oh no i love Hound. I hate you so much. This is the one thing my deck is not supposed to go against. Immediately, Royal Giant on that other lane right now. I cannot be dealing with this. Oh, you suck, dude. You suck. I hate this guy right away. This dude has the one thing I did not want to see, and that is the Lava Hound. So let's get some minions down on that, and oh my god, I am actually upset right now. This dude has to have the one troop I did not want to see. Thank god he didn't do too good, but I have like zero air defense in this deck, so I was just really scared for a second. I was expecting something much worse to happen, but luckily we managed to make it work, so I'm not going to complain. We're doing decent action actually now that oh my god another lava hound this dude can't be serious so once this lava actually another royal giant let's put a royal giant over there and let's get a zap ready we can actually counter this correctly so let's wait one two zap boom and there goes the zap send some minions in those minions might have just screwed us up but oh yeah look at that the royal giant on the right side is tearing it up for us and that oh crap um, let's put a mini P.E.K.K.A. in the back. Let's zap all of that right there. And this guy's push didn't actually do that good again. So far, this dude is not doing too good. Now we can Royal Giant. That Royal Giant might have been a bit rushed, but... Oh, we actually know it wasn't. We might be able to do the push right here. Oh, crap, never mind. I was hoping we'd be, we'd be able to uh, do the Bomb Tower push, but... It doesn't look like we will have enough elixir to do that. And right now, we're actually doing pretty decent as it is. So I'm pretty happy right now. Next, let's kind of put mini packet down. And we can just zap all that out. Honestly, that was a bit spooky. I'm not going to lie. But we managed to come out of it successfully. So right now, this is it right here. This is the push. Let's get it, guys. Let's actually, never mind. I can't do it right now. I really can't afford to be wasting my time on this crap. So we have to kind of get some hits off. I am a bit spooked. I'm not going to lie. Oh, crap. We have to work something out. He has the princess in the back, which is not good. And this dude has a really high hitting deck or a really heavy deck. So right now, let's just try not to lose. Uh, what do we do? We do have a zap, which is good for us. Let's take that out. Next, let's get the royal giant down. Now we need to save up for that bomb tower oh the royal yes we won i don't know how we won the mini becca was actually up there what i need to go watch that back real quick we need to play that back in times four i'll be back in a second Okay, so I believe the ending of this battle does happen right here. Look at the mini P.E.K.K.A. The mini P.E.K.K.A. just ran over there and got a few hits in on his own. And the dude didn't even try to counter it, really. So, you know, good game, boss. Thanks for the three trophies. And I'm actually surprised we beat a Lava Hound user. So let's get another battle going. And we are against Ketchup from Bulldog Nation. He says good luck. So I'll give him the thumbs up and say good luck back. And he said good game already. Oh, my God. We're doomed. We are doomed. Okay, let's just play it slow and we should be good. That's all we have to do. Play slow and we will be cool. You feel me? So now let's just put some minions down. We got a mini push of our own going. He does have an ice wizard, but luckily for us, we have some archers to take those out. Um, that was a very strange minor. I'm not going to lie, but we managed to come out pretty good with that. 
Uh, do I want to commit? No, we're not going to commit now. I think I should chill and save up on Elixir. Let's get a zap on standby, though, because... Oh! Oh, my... Oh, I thought we were going to get him. Now, luckily for us, we do actually have the furnace. So, the furnace is going to help us out a lot right here. Oh, rip. That is not too good for us. Um... Next, let's put the archers up top. She should take out that princess. And yeah, we just managed to counter him again. Oh, we actually have another mini good push. So right now, this is actually looking pretty good for us. There goes his ice wizard. And our ice wizard is just going to do some chip damage. So we're not getting a lot of hits in. And oh, yes, this is it, guys. We are doing the push right now. I have faith in it. We can finally get it out. Here it is. Here it is. Now, oh, no, he has the minion horde. Are you kidding me? Wow, let's zap all that out of there. Oh, what do we do? What do we do? What What do I do, guys? Oh, no. <laughs> we just got smacked. What was that? That was my one biggest fear because if they place air troops on that, we are pretty much screwed every time. Right now, we're at a pretty big disadvantage, so we have to come up with something. It does look like we will end up losing this battle, and I would like to kind of keep my trophies, so I'm not really looking forward to this too much. Oh, I just wasted my mini packet too, which is fantastic, I tell you guys. But right now, we do have a slightly better push coming. This should be a little bit better than what we previously did just have i'm gonna zap all of that out of there oh never mind we are so doomed right now this isn't even funny oh wait we might actually come back we have faith there is faith in this battle i know oh my god we can win we can win crap i forgot i didn't even see that miner oh my god I do have faith we can win this, but it is going to take us some skill because right now we're definitely lacking. We are missing out on something. We're not doing too good right now, so we do need to make some major plays if we do want to win this. So let's just, you know, try to play to the best of our ability and whatever happens, happens. So he does keep placing miners. Let's just take care of him next. Um, let's zap all that out of there. We do need to kind of get an ice wizard in the front. Okay, this is looking pretty decent. Let's get you down right there. Oh, that was terrible. I don't think we're going to win this battle whatsoever. There is 40 seconds left, and this guy does seem like he is going to win just from the miner, actually. This guy's miner is saving him, and right now, I'm actually going to use a defensive bomb tower because this dude has a lot of like, small units, I guess. Also, this guy's princesses are kind of spooking me out a bit, so I'm going to zap those to get him to retarget. And yeah, at this point, I don't think we're going to win. I think we are screwed. Um, yeah, good, good game catch up. So far within two battles, I haven't actually got to try this strategy yet. So let's give this one more try and hopefully we can actually pull it off. I really want to try to get the bomb tower behind the royal giant. We got it once last battle, but he kind of had a minion horde, so it didn't work out. But let's just see what happens this battle. We're against Extreme Gamer, and this idiot spelled his name wrong. Extreme! Look how he spelled stream. I feel bad for this person right off the bat because he doesn't know how to spell. Oh, man. Huh. Well, good luck to this guy. So let's zap. Boom. And this should be good for us right there. I'm not too concerned right away. Um, the Royal Giant is going to get melted. Let's put some archers down in the back. Oh, God, that Royal Giant has not been melted. He just melted us. Holy crap. Let's get an Ice Wizard up front. And oh, no, this isn't going good. I have already lost faith in this battle. And I'm just going to make this clear right now. I do not use the Royal Giant normally. I just figured this seems like an interesting challenge. Let's give it a go. Who knows? It might be funny. It might be interesting. So, yeah, don't hate on me for this. I usually use a miner, and that, that's not any better whatsoever. But, yeah. We are placing the furnace down, and we kind of have to wait until two times elixir if we want to get this push off. And right away, I know what this guy is going to be doing. I kind of already learned what? Place down, you damn mini Pekka. And this guy does have a miner, which will be going down most likely. So there goes that. And now I would like to push. Oh crap, never mind. Let's actually get our ice wizard down, and let's get some minions down in the back. Let's take out all of this guy's supporting troops. That way he can't get too many hits off. And I can't even afford to push at this point. This guy. 
guy is just keeping me on my toes and he's not really letting me do too much so um i gotta kind of figure out a plan or something because we are kind of screwed right now here it is the strategy of a lifetime oh it worked zap it all it, it is working no way we just got it to work you have to be kidding me. That was awesome. I don't even care it wasn't that effective. Now that we have this, this is the best strategy ever. So real quickly, we're going to get this strategy working better than this person's. Look at ours go. We have this in the bag without a doubt. Next, we do have that miner, which does need to be taken care of. And let's also save up for that mini P.E.K.K.A. And right now, his royal giant is targeted onto my furnace. So boom, there goes that. And now we are actually getting this strategy looking pretty good good holy crap i'm actually really happy with how this is going and right now um this doesn't look too good for us he has a lot of crap which we need to take care of so i'm actually gonna zap all that out right there and i don't think we have too much of a chance right here i'm pretty sure we did just lose this battle but i got the bomb tower strategy to work i'm happy with that so oh well 39 trophies too fantastic so if you guys are going to be trying this strategy expect some high trophy losses or i don't know who knows this might actually work for you guys so if you guys want to go out and try a similar deck with the royal giant and the bomb tower please feel free to do so and tweet me the results as you guys saw for me it didn't work out too good but i do feel like if perfected this can be like the biggest scumbag strategy in the entire game so please tell me how this works if you guys want to try it for yourselves and if you guys made it this far in the video i'm assuming you like the video so if you haven't already please feel free to give the video a like down below and if you're new to my channel subscribe for more daily clash royale content but guys this has been eclipse and peace out